banks set up fairly significant compliance operations to make sure that they could try to live by the rules on anti-money laundering and counter finance and terrorism. Um, as the fines have gone up, the compliance costs have gone up. And um, uh, uh, setting up these compliance regimes usually gets into how do you know your customer. Um, knowing your customer, what is, are they involved in anything nefarious and so forth, it's hard to do. It's really hard to do in poorer countries where information flow is not as great, data is not as ava uh, available. And it's even more, more difficult in post-conflict countries, which almost by definition uh, have these concerns. So um, as banks have figured out, it is now a, a risk on top of a risk on top of a risk just to do basic banking services in countries where, from a policy perspective, we would love to see good competitive financial flows going, and, they're, and banks are just saying, um, not today, I'm leaving, because I do not want to take on the risk of having this huge fine on a margin business in which I can only earn a few thousand dollars.